Welcome back to It's Tool Thing. Today with another tool haul video, I picked up a couple items. Um, first things I picked up were uh, this William socket, inch and seven sixteenths. See, it's uh, pretty rough shape. Crumbs coming off, 12 point. Um, I'm actually think I'm gonna, somebody at work needed an inch and 7 16ths or 36 millimeters, so I picked this one up and I was going to give them one of my other ones. Um, figured I might as well upgrade to a, a USA made one, uh, even if it is in rough shape. I don't use it very often, but uh, I picked that up. And then this is just a cheap uh, 1719 offset wrench power torque. This is the one I'm missing in Snap On. Um, I keep trying to get one, but I'm just not willing to pay. $35 for a wrench that I'm barely ever going to use uh, I'm holding out for a better deal. I ended up picking up both these for Six bucks if I remember right um, So I thought that was a pretty good deal. It's probably do what I need though. I do actually Need a 17 millimeter offset or would be an advantage. I think I was able to do it with a, a Regular angle head wrench, but I think this would probably be a little bit better But uh, we'll give it a shot see what we think um next thing this item here it's a snap-on bluetooth speaker give you the part number here it's a ct bt 599 excuse me 59050 uh runs off the 18 volt snap-on which is actually the issue i have with it um I don't have any of these batteries. I was I tried one of the guys in the shop today and it does work with it. I did test it with the the 110. I figured it'll be sitting on my toolbox so it wouldn't be a big deal until I realized uh every time I move my box, which is multiple times a day is a lot of times, that it's gonna shut off on me. So I'm trying to figure out if I can scrounge up one battery or something or um, maybe convert it to a run off a Milwaukee battery or something, but I couldn't find an adapter. If anybody has any ideas, um, I've seen an adapter for the lithium snap on 18 volts. Um, I could see multiple adapters for Milwaukee, but none of them went to snap on. There's certainly none of them went to the, the current one. Some of them did the older snap on, I think. Um, and they were kind of pricey just for the item anyways it does have two usb poles here on the side an auxiliary in and a, a plug for headphone if you want to go that route uh sound was pretty decent on it things in pretty good shape uh the pawn shop that had it they actually had the air air inflator also or whatever snap on calls it no batteries or anything with any of it and they've had them for a long time so they actually had them on clearance i just ended up buying this one since i didn't have a battery the other one doesn't run off anything but the battery um ended up picking this thing up for 30 bucks so i thought that was a pretty good deal i've been wanting to get a second one of those milwaukee speakers and i figured this would work but now i'm gonna have to uh figure out some way to run auxiliary power just mostly for when i move from one bay to another um anybody got any ideas like i said please leave them in the comments below uh, maybe if somebody even has one of these batteries they might be willing to to part with cheap or doesn't work i'd be interested and maybe i can modify the battery or something uh leave a comment down below on that and then the last item nothing fancy here i actually have some nicer of these little creeper seats but i like that small one the one i put a video up or a post up a while ago uh that i broke the seat on which i've had i bought that thing at um, GI Joe's they've been closed forever, but it was probably 20 years ago when I bought that thing and I've changed the wheels out of it a couple of times I can fix the seat and I still might but the wheels themselves are worn out again um, My sister actually found this item and told me about it uh, I don't know exactly if it's gonna last. I don't think it's probably just as good quality the other one was but uh, It was like 20 bucks or 22 bucks. So it was on sale so I figured I might as well grab it for now because I like having one of these. This one actually fits in the little Mac 
cart that I used at the end of my box so I can keep it with me where the bigger Mac and Snap-on ones I have don't fit down in the bottom very well. So I went ahead and picked that up. Please like and subscribe, comment down below, and as always, have a great day.